Hi, in this tutorial, I'll talk about AEM page versioning. Sometimes you need multiple backup of your pages. This is achieved in AEM using the out-of-box functionality called page versioning or page version. So with page versioning, you can create a snapshot of page at a specific point of time. In general term, what does this mean? You can create backup of your page at any point of time and you can have multiple backups at a different time. So basically you can perform three operations here. You can create page version, you can store page version or you can store to any version. You can have multiple versions for the different time and you can restore any version. And you can compare the current version with the existing versions. And it will show you different differences in different color. Like if you removed something, delete something, so that will be shown in red. If you added something that will be shown in green. So I just gave a reference about the colors. Basically, it will show you what are the content removed or added. Now let's understand how this work in AEM. Okay, so whatever the page you want to create a version, let's say for example, hypothetical example, I have a version called page and I want to create, I want to add this, edit this page. But before I added this page, I need a backup of it, backup of this page, right? So what you can do, you can create version, means package, you can create a package of it, but creating multiple packages is not a feasible solution. And the package console, sometimes the authors does not have access to that package control. So AEM give you a pretty easy and simple way. So what you can do, let's say I will update this page, but before that I need a backup. So what I'll do, go here, select this page and create. You will find a second option called versions, right? So now you can create version. You can give any label or if you, even if you don't give, you can create that. Let's say geeks version one, okay? And you can give any comment, like say first version, right? You create here. So as soon as you create this version, you will see a version here. It's created now. Let's say now, let's say I update to this page or edit something let's say i change this title here this one and i will change this to h1 and i will save it okay and let's say remove some products as well from here okay i remove it two products three now the three okay i have added this page now what i want at this point of time, if I think like I need, let's say you send this for review, uh, review is not successful. So what happened? You want the existing content, which was earlier when you started this editing, you want that content. So you can restore that page. Okay. First, let me, let me, let me tell you, let, let's say you want to create one more backup at this point of time. So what you'll do again, go back here and create one more version. Let's say geeks version. Okay. This is you have to create version select this page and create version again okay, let's say geeks version 2 all right and now i need more authoring so what i'll do let me add few more authoring to it let me change this one and i'll change the text okay i'll add test save and here test all right and let me change the image as well here okay image i'll change one image here okay so it's done now now if you check here let's say now, for example, let me show you how it look like. So this is the page now. Say I'm not happy. So I want my initial page, which were I, which were whatever the content it it has earlier when I started. Or I can go to the second checkpoints, means the second version. So what you can do, come here again, and you will see. Click on this. So you will see the three options, right? So preview, 
compare and restore this version so preview basically will show you the this version let me show you preview okay my firefox is blocking it so let me allow from localhost so okay let me close all this and let me do it again preview so the preview will show you how the page look like as at the first version so you will see here even you can compare see this even i removed uh, i did this but you can see the how the initial page look like okay and you can compare with the current as well so you will see the current version and the versions means current page and the version side by side so you see this is my uh, the version okay this was the my version and this is my current page look like so you see this i removed this so that's why it is showing in red and i added this one because i changed it i added uh, h1 so it will it show like the green one so now what i can do i can restore any versions first you have to select the page uh, when you select you will see all the versions available and let me restore this if i restore this version okay it's done if i open this page now let's say this one i open now i did not refresh this so you see this second uh, all the edits after second version and i've refreshed this you will see the page how it was at initially when started you know authoring you see this okay now even i can go back to the second version as well right now so now i have two versions i can go to this any of the version let me revert to the second version and if i refresh this see it, it will show you the second version at the second uh, while creating the second version i change this title and remove these products okay and even i change uh, okay i th this is the only thing i did this feature is really useful for content authors when you want to update or edit any page you can create a version before starting it so that you have a restore point you have a checkpoint for your authoring i hope you understood this was a very simple concept but important for authoring if you have any question add your comment thank you